blaring, police respond to a high school's call for help. Four students shot as classes were letting out. A gunman walking into an Oregon high school, heading straight for that locker room, opening fire, killing one student, others running for cover. Imaginably, 18-year-old Brandy Vela shot and killed herself right in front of her parents and her grandparents. Her family says she was being bullied because of her weight and that she just couldn't take it anymore. Uh, we implemented P3 Campus at the beginning of the school year. In the first month, we had a 62% increase in reports or tips. This just tells us that the students, if given this technology, they'll use it, and the key is anonymity. Not all students are comfortable speaking with an administrator about their social emotional concerns, so the P3 Campus app allows them to submit their concern anonymously and then we can start the process of supporting that student where, where we see necessary. Through the promotion of P3 Campus this year, we found that students are actually using the app to report things to us. Uh, most of the students that we see that are reporting to us have some mental health or some kind of social crisis that they're facing. We can pass that information on to the professionals within the school district to handle those non-criminal situations. In Washington State, an 11-year-old boy appeared in court today after bringing several knives, a gun, and 400 rounds of ammunition to school. According to court documents, the boy told police he heard voices in his head telling him to, to defend a friend being bullied. The P3 Campus app gives students a voice that may not be comfortable coming in right away for a face-to-face -face meeting, so it gives them a chance to get off their chest what they need to and eventually allow us to get to the point of possibly even seeing them face-to-face.